Okay, I'm back. Now I haven't figured out a way to distribute from layers to keyframes going across in time, but I know that there's a way to, to do it from um, a bunch of objects on the stage to distribute them to layers. So you can go one way but not the other. So this is how I'm going to solve the problem. Shadow 2 is for frame 2, so I'm going to take this keyframe for shadow 2 and I'm just going to drag it over and down and now it's in um, keyframe 2. So shadow 2 is now in keyframe 2. Then I'll take frame 2 and just drag it over and then drop it down. So now it's next to frame 1. So these will be my shadows. And these will be my, um, I'll put boy, or in, in this case it's my son Dominic. So anyway, now I have um, shadows and then um, the boy on that layer. And then now I can delete these two layers eventually when I want to. But I don't have to do it right now. What I'll do is go to shadow 3, drag it over two frames, and then just drop it down. And then um, frame 3, just drag it over two frames and drop it down. So now I have a... Uh, three uh, frame animation and I just need to um, maybe now would be a good time to start deleting a few layers that are empty so I can trash can that and frame this layer I can drag that to the trash can and this one right here this is an empty layer right here I can trash can that and so now for four shadow four drag it over and drop it down and you may want to make sure not to drag one keyframe on top of another because it'll actually wipe out that keyframe. So notice how I'm very careful to drag it over and then drop it down so I don't replace it by accident. That's kind of important. Okay, that looks good. And so now I'll just highlight those empty layers right there and press the trash can tool. And uh, and now I have those. So now all I have to do is come in again with the rest of these and get these all lined up one at a time. And then I'll have my animation. Um, so now you can see the animation starting to come to life. Okay, I'll be 